What's good, everybody? It's your boy Joe Money here with DJ Boss Perry and the rest of the Hip Hop Corner WMUC. We sitting here right now with a extravagant figure in the DC area, man. A guy with a lot of notoriety, Tony Lewis Jr. Something in the building. What's good, man? So we here tonight at the show. What's it called? Underground Kings, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, man, how do you feel like hip hop unites our community? Um, I think hip hop is very important. Um, I think the whole DC and that movement that I started maybe like a year and a half ago was centered around the importance of hip hop and right. how we could bridge the gaps. Um, but I felt like it was some gaps that need to be bridged within the hip hop community that could assist me in bridging the gaps in the street. So we kind of worked that hand in hand. Um, myself, of course Wale, right. and the uh, whole BOF, BOA family. Um, and, and from that, it's just the Spawn, Fat Trail, God the Chosen One. You know, the list goes on and on. Black Cobain, uh, Phil I Day, you know, the whole 368, everybody has been right. coming together because I was like one person that that everybody kind of you know had respect for, and I kind of utilized that man, and, you know, build some bridges. So, and if y'all don't know, that's he when he talking about Wale and all of that, he was in the song Bait, and he, he shouted my man out. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so basically, and what about the song DC and nothing on ambition? Too, okay, you know what I mean. So, can the you, movement kind of inspired that. Can you talk a little bit about directly what the program is? Oh well, DC and nothing really is a is an entire movement. My mm -hmm. my my program is called Sons of Life. We mentor kids and college for their parents. Yeah. We do a lot of other stuff in the community, like feeding the homeless, um, you know, raising awareness for sexual and physically abused kids. But DC and Nothing is just another level of all of that, which is calling for civic engagement, but also uh, support for the local music scene. Okay. So, you know, and from that, you know, we tag in every event we do, every community thing we do is, is going to fall under the umbrella of DC and Nothing. Um, you know, I feel like United, man, we can do anything we want to do. So. Certainly. Yeah. Speaking from an activism standpoint, you know, can you express to the audience kind of what it's like to, to be so positive coming from a place of negativity? You know, I don't know what people may know about your background, your family, whatever have you, but, yeah. you know, you're doing all these great things for the community where it might seem like, you know, it would be the opposite. Yeah, absolutely. You know? I, I think what's crazy, man, sometimes when you when you born into something, you know, a lot of people choose the street. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I'm, 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 I'm of the street. Like, I come mm -hmm. from it. Like, And I don't say that in, in, in any way to glorify it. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? But when you have that that vantage point, um, you really get a chance to see death and destruction. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, 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 and it becomes a situation where everybody around you dead and locked up, and you don't want that for yourself. Mm -hmm. um, but because of that, people understand how genuine my efforts are. And, and how quote unquote real I am. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? My, my whole thing is to really show people that ain't not fly about none of that that I come from. Right. You know what I mean? I've been able to circumvent and navigate through it and become a positive thing. Like I was saying on the other piece, like, you know, I've been on American Gangster twice, man, for not mm -hmm. being one. I'm yeah. super proud of that. You know what I mean? Yeah, so. Respect that's on what that. It's about. All right, man. Well, you know, we appreciate you coming through talking. I guess before you go, is there anything you wanted to say, you know, about the community or, or, or how we can increase the peace and all that? Yeah, I just think, man, people, we, we just need to kind of, you, know, um, you know, love more, man. I'm really about that. Okay, understand the consequences of your actions, man, before you do them. Just at least consider them. You know what I mean? Um, every grown adult got to pay their own consequences. Yeah. I ain't never been the preachy type. Right. But I'm dealing with dudes, you know, every day that come home from, from doing 30, 40 years in prison and trying to help them restart their lives, man. You don't want to be that. You know what? I had another question that popped in my head yeah. from what you said. How do you talk to the young brothers who they don't really want to hear that? You know, ignorance is a lot of times just bliss, uh, and a lot of times you, you facing up against point. people who, you know, they really just don't want to hear it, basically. Like, if you look at things like the music, you know, yeah. the stuff we're talking about in there is not going to lead you to making better decisions. Right. So what is it going to take? You know, what, how do you really think that you're going to get pulled up as young brothers? Yeah, man, that's a good question. I, I, I think... If everybody um just do their part, man, you know what I'm saying. Those of us that are positive, we gotta really, you know, cause they do, they they play like they don't want to hear it. They want to hear they it. Need it yeah, yeah. They need it. You know, it's all and it's all how you don't talk at young, it's talk to them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. At least with me, a lot of them, you know, it's a lot of they don't gotta look far to find out who I am yeah. and what I'm about. Your respect. Yeah, that's the buy-in that come along with being me. You know what I mean? But uh, I think we all can gain that, and you gotta be consistent. You gotta think a lot of these kids, especially from men, they don't they don't see men, they don't grow with men, so. They Trust me, you feel mm -hmm. me? So we gotta be consistent, man. It, it can happen, it gotta happen. All right, that's a yeah. bet. Straight like that, man. Like I said, Hip Hop Corner, Tony Lewis Jr., your boy Joe Money. It's a wrap. Thank you, appreciate it. All right. All right.